as a head of school, you couldn't be more proud of your community when they just take difficult times, difficult days, and learn and grow. This school as a whole has been a leader in technology. That's kind of in the culture of this place. When they originally announced the lockdown, we only initially planned on leaving school for about three weeks. Three weeks became six, and then six became the rest of the school year. We went to our faculty about three weeks before anybody else was thinking about shutting down. We just said to the faculty, we got to get ready. We, we need to be ready. And so we introduced them to Zoom. So we rolled over to it pretty easily as far as that's concerned. So we were super fortunate. Our kids were already one-to-one -one iPads and computers. So that it was easier for us, I think, than the norm. We're teaching um, at school, but yet the students are remote. That's been the biggest challenge. So when we're separated, specifically in theater, where you really need that ensemble feel to do a lot of acting exercises and be vulnerable, because doing things in front of each other is really what stretches you. So the D10 board for me has been life-changing in all of this. We really did love the D10, and it was connected to Zoom, which we had already loved as well, and had spent a lot of time building capacity and, and training on then that marriage kind of solidified that focus of where we sit today. This allows at least somewhat of a personal connection with the students and with their, with their teachers and with each other even for that matter. I just like that Zoom has a little bit more streamlined features and it's accessible on your phone, your iPad, your laptop and everything and I think that's one of the coolest things. At first it was so odd, now it feels like that's just normal to talk to your kids you know, on a screen. Zoom was just intuitive. Teachers don't have a lot of patience for things that are difficult. Students don't have a lot of patience for things that are difficult. I think breakout rooms is an amazing feature on Zoom because it helps with group projects. Just to talk with peers about an assignment and then going back to discuss it with the teacher. Two or three months ago, to go to a faculty member and say you need to teach kids 100% remote, synchronously, in a way that's engaging, in a way that connects them, would have seemed not just foreign, but it would have seemed impossible. It has made me extremely proud because of the way that we have utilized Zoom and the way that we have continued to function. We're doing our very best to provide what we think is a quality education, teaching students how to learn. The students feel empowered. They are a voice. Um, that's heard. That, that was huge for me. Zoom made that possible. Great technologies become invisible. As we look to the future, I think Zoom, they've become that invisible partner that allows us to accomplish that mission of empowering students and learners to, to their highest potential.